Hello. A few months ago, a question was raised on the forum of Prezi on the URL that you can see on the screen. If it's possible to create links that jump to other parts of a presentation of a Prezi. And there were some answers to that and <coughs> because this was a topic that I was also interested in how to do this. Um, I was searching it and I found some replies that were really useful but uh, it was not obvious to understand the procedure how to create such links and therefore after I examined it a little bit and tried to play around with I decided to make a short video that tells you how you can create uh, links how you can go inside Prezi to a different part of the presentation and not just linearly through the path that you create. I assume that you are familiar with Prezi and what you see right now is the editing screen of my presentation that actually demonstrates this feature. So uh, what, we, what I have here is a presentation we are in show mode at this very moment uh, that starts here at the start then go on normal but then it splits into three different trails so the viewer can choose if he wants to go this trail the A or this trail the B or this trail the C and after he or she finishes we can continue here until we finish. So let's play this presentation. So we start, we go on normal then, and then we get uh, this screen which says that we have to select A, B, or C. So I click on B and then I press the button to the right so I go on and then we are on the trail B. Now if I go back with the back button and uh, yeah okay so if I go back to here at this one and I uh, select A you will see what this little glitch was uh, when, uh, later on when I show you. So if I click on A then we go on the trail A and when one of the trail is finished then uh, it says that click here before continue and then I click here and press the right key again right arrow and I go to the finish so now I step out of editing mode and I show you how it looks like so here is the presentation And actually, if we look at the pass, then you can see that this is a very complex pass, which just goes helter-skelter, but not really helter-skelter. It has a lot very logical structure. So we start here. This is normal. Then two, and then we are here. And here I have four, three, which is uh, for this um, invisible frame. I use this invisible frame so that on one screen you can see click on A, B or C before continue and the letters A, B or C. If uh, C is put uh, here instead of the frame then uh, you would not see zooming on it during playing A, B or and C. Therefore it's on actually on the frame itself. Then we go on with the first tray. So it says A text A1, A2 and A3. Then because we want to finish the trail when the user plays it, we come here. Here we continue and it says click here before continue. And when we finish the trail then we will Clicking here, forget the rest of the trails, and then we go on to the end of the presentation. But the pass itself, 
from here when we got here from seven the step number eight we come back here with step number nine then we go on with this trail then step number 13 then come here we go again this uh, the last trail and then we are here again uh, but this time already there is no need to click here but we can see click here anyway if the user clicks here then he finishes and then we just go on so <clears throat> using the possibility that uh, if you click on an object which is at a different part of the pass then Prezi presentation will continue from that part it's very easy to create different trays for your presentation it can be very useful if you want to implement a presentation which is not linear which you do not present in the usual sense that you stand on a podium in front of your audience and you just talk 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 but rather you talk interactively somebody asks you something you, you can jump to that part or if you want to pub publish a presentation that may be very detailed and some areas which may not interest everybody just some people then you may offer different trails to go through your presentation and some pass part some part of the pass may be skipped by some of your audiences I hope that this uh, short video helped you understand how to create a multi trail pass in Prezi and enjoy Prezi just as I enjoy it. Thank you for your attention.